What is up guys, Dr. Typo here and I am back on Destiny to show you how to get everyone's new favorite toy, the Black Spindle. The Black Spindle is actually just a knockoff of the Black Hammer. As a matter of fact, it pretty much is the Black Hammer. However, for some reason they changed the name and they went ahead and they made it an exotic weapon. Now, in all actuality, this is actually very difficult to obtain, at least right now. I'm sure once everybody gets, you know, much, much better gear, this will be very easy to obtain, but for the time being, it's really not easy at all. Now, what you're going to need to do this, first of all, is you're going to have to load up the Lost to Light mission, and you're going to have to load it up when it is the Daily Heroic. That's right, the only time that you're going to be able to get this weapon is when it's the Daily Heroic. However, it's going to appear often in the rotation, at least that's what one of the heads over at Bungie have said. So considering that the stars have aligned correctly, and this is the daily right now, go ahead, get yourself some friends together, and then prepare for a beating. Because this is actually, like I said, very tough to do. Now all you're going to have to do is just follow the route you see me take there. You're going to open that second rune door, and then you're going to skip the third rune door in the mission, Lost to Light, and you're going to instead go over here to the fallen ship. Now after you fight your way through waves and waves of Taken, all the way to the end of the fallen ship you're going to fight a taken boss now like i said this is very tough and this is the tough part ads are going to keep spawning and they will keep spawning all you can do is take care of the black orbs that spawn ads and put all fire that you can on the boss and to make matters worse you have a time limit 10 minutes from the time that you get inside the fallen ship to the time that you kill the boss. That's how much time you have. And if you fail, it will kick you back to orbit and you will have to restart the mission. Also, if you happen to die at all while you are making your way towards the fallen ship, go ahead and kick yourself back to orbit because you will not have access and you're going to have to restart all over from the very beginning, not from whatever checkpoint it puts you at. But that's really all there is to it. Just go ahead and kill the boss. After you kill him, you're going to have to kill all the waves of Taken that are left over, and then you will be given your just reward. Now, I really suggest bringing, you know, a weapon that has every single element type. You, you, know, you know what I'm talking about. Have a weapon in each slot for each element type. That way you can really make this much easier because you're going to be fighting shields that are void, fire, and art you're you're really going to want to bring weapons that are versatile now for the time being this is a 310 exotic weapon there are no others like it as of yet and bungie has claimed they are nerfing it to a 290 which is 20 more points you know i mean let's do the math there 20 points below anyways what you can do is infuse it with some other weapons and retain that 310 you know all you're gonna have to do is infuse two of them because yes you can go do this on multiple characters and get three of these black spindles hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button take two and call me in the morning